This is a benchmark video of the Gigabyte 1060 WinForce OC 6 Gigabyte version. So right here you can see um, this is in the gaming mode without playing any game. I'm just sitting on my desktop and you can see the temperature is sitting at about 40 degrees Celsius right now. Um, so I'd like you guys to keep in mind that my apartment has no AC. So the room that I was recording in was approximately 78 degrees Fahrenheit or 25 degrees Celsius. So keep in mind, your temperatures will probably be cooler if you guys have AC. So hopping in The Witcher 3, I ran around for a couple minutes just to get the card going um, in gaming mode while running a game on max settings. And you can see here that the temperature spiked up to about 65 degrees Celsius, uh, which you can see with the fan curve that's set on auto. Uh, I was running at about, say, 50% fan speed. Um, so you can also obviously set your own fan curve, but it seems to be okay using the auto fan curve, but if you would like it to run in silent mode, um, you can do that. So I hopped in The Witcher 3, you know, ran around for a couple more minutes and saw the temperature spike all the way up to 70 degrees Celsius. But uh, my room was getting progressively hotter. So at 70 degrees Celsius, the fans were running at about 60 um, percent, which is why the fan speed was at about 1500 RPM. Um, so as even as I was just sitting here, you can see the GPU temperature spiking up a little bit higher to 72 degrees Celsius. But again, I'd like you guys to remember I was recording with Shadowplay and Shadowplay uses the GPU to record. So on top of having no AC and recording using my graphics card, it was spiking the temperature a little bit. And also, for some reason, you cannot select the OC mode. However, what you can do is go into advanced settings and manually um, type in the max and min megahertz and the uh, clock offset if you wish. So going over to Gigabyte's page directly, uh, you can see that the OC mode that you're supposed to be able to click on within easy settings but you can't is 1,797 megahertz in boost mode with a base clock of 1,582 in the OC mode. So if you really need that 20 megahertz difference, and honestly, I don't really think it's a very big deal, but if you do need it, you should be able to go to the advanced settings within the OC um, software itself and just type that in if you really want it. I'm hoping since this card just got released that in the near future, they're going to either release a firmware update, if it's the firmware that's preventing um, it from being chosen within the software itself, or they're just gonna release a software update that unlocks it. But overall, it's a little bit odd that this is advertised as the OC edition and you're not actually allowed to click the OC mode within the software. So I'm a little unhappy with that, but overall, this card is fantastic and I'm pleased with the attempts despite not having AC, so yours should be even better.